Hello everyone and welcome to Clive Barker's Undying. I don't know anything about this game except that it's spooky and cheesy and old. So that's great. We are going to do, last week we did all of the Outlast games for Spooky Season and this week we're going to Retro. Next week, assuming we finish Clive Barker this week, Next week we're gonna go to back to modern and do Amnesia: Dark Descent, and after that we're gonna go into Resident Evil. That is the plan. Current retro, current retro. Kind of mixing it up, you know. What year is this game? Um, I don't know. I'm gonna guess early 2000s. 2001. Yes. Well, is it? It's not that. Is it that scary? Probably not. I mean, we just played Outlast. This is, this is gonna be like a piece of cake inside of a cake inside of cheese. Right? <laughs> Maybe not. I don't know. I have no idea what to expect. <laughs> Alright. New game! Oh, god damn it. I don't know. Medium. Nineteen twenty-three, October. Uh, I'm tired of traveling, or fighting superstition and its many manifestations. Even though it was me who chose to debunk folklore and mysticism, little did I know I'd end up being labeled as Patrick Galloway, the man with endless occult knowledge. Before I knew it, people all over the world paid me to investigate all kinds of weird things. <laughs> as long as they paid me, I'd look into it. Funny thing, though, the more I saw the more I believe there are forces beyond our control. Creatures not explainable in any human terms. Things that make me skin crawl. I fled from Ireland and hung around Paris and London with no real purpose till the Great War started. I joined a special unit whose job it was to squelch the fears of the superstitious farm boys who made up the fighting ranks. The Trasanti were the biggest pains. New commanding officer, Jeremiah Covenant, led our unit in the hunt for their camp. We were ambushed. They came streaming out of the woods, waving swords and howling like banshees. I saw their leader holding a strange stone over his head, yelling weird words in a strange tongue. And just when he was going to pull the trigger, he glared right at me. A bright green flash came from his hand, and it bowled me over as my gun went off. I woke up in a hospital bed with severe burns. They told me Jeremiah and the unit had gone on without me, but he'd given me the shaman stone to keep. I hadn't given any of this much thought until I came back here to find this letter that Jeremiah wrote me almost six months ago, asking me to come back to Ireland and help him out. This is not something I'm dying to do, for it may mean the death of me. He saved my life though, so I owe it to him. Just hope it's not too late. Wow. And we're thrown in, okay? So we're we're an Irishman? That's freaking awesome. <laughs> okay. I believe this is this is how little I know about this game. It's a shooter, I'm pretty sure, right? A horror shooter game. Check for subtitles. Sure, yes. Uh, video? We got desired FPS. That's interesting. I'm gonna probably look at that later, but I don't see any subtitle options. Audio might have subtitle options? Maybe. 3D hardware, voiceover, sound effects. I'm gonna turn sound effects down a little bit. I'm guessing ambient is music. I want voiceover up all the way. Yeah, doesn't look good guys, sorry. Okay. Everything look and sound okay, other than the fact that we don't have subtitles? Jack. What'd you say? Did 
I just... Whoa! That guy wasn't there a second ago. Um, what's happening right now? Excuse me? Did you just attack me? It's an evil rat mouse thing. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Okay. Uh, so I can push people back with my green stone. <laughs> Is that because there's a guy right there hanging? Get out of here! Whoa! So that doesn't seem like it uses any. You thirsty? I've got a couple of. What? You got a couple of what? The important detail of that sentence was totally drowned out by the lighting. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it was Jeremiah thunderclap. <laughs> okay. Well. My name's Jer. Let's just let's just go by Jer. You know. Stock. Jer. Jer. Won't budge. Won't budge. Stock. Stock. Won't budge. Budge. Won't budge. I don't even have to click. I just run into it. Won't budge. It's kind of a Geralt situation. Just run your face into things and hope that they work. All right. So I'm gonna use my purple ability, and then I'm gonna go look at this. <laughs> Fortunate for that guy. Hey, what happened to that guy that's hanging in another ghost realm? Hey, hey. All right then. What about over here? Anything? I'm not teeny enough to fit in there. I guess that's for the rats. Yeah, I don't have the manual. I mean, I could look up the manual from GOG. I could do that. Yes, I could. But let's just go until I get stuck first. I'm Patrick Galloway, a friend of Jeremiah's. Sorry it took me so long to get here. His letter said it was most urgent. Jeremiah is beginning to think that the letter never arrived in your hands. He's been quite anxious to see you. Oh. We've all been quite worried. Wait, did the other guy Jeremiah thought I was Jeremiah? Now bedridden. Follow me and I'll show you to his living quarters. Okay. I apologize for the look of the house, but there's only a skeleton crew of servants now. Jeremiah let go of everyone else, and the house is much too large for us to clean. Because we've lost electricity to most parts of the house, we can only maintain the living quarters. This family's had so much tragedy. I hope you can help him. I'll do my best. All right. GOG forum says there's no subtitles. Isn't that a bummer? Maybe there's not a lot of dialogue in the game. Maybe, maybe it'll be fine. Oh. That guy's creepy. Ah! Okay. Cool. Stuck. Stuck. Patrick, you made it. Jeremiah? At your service, Jeremiah. Sorry for the delay, but I've been abroad. What happened to you? It seems I've come under the watchful eye of the Reaper, my friend. Reaper? It's been a long time, hasn't it? Apparently too long. 
Patrick, I came back from the war only to find my entire estate in disarray. My brother Aaron disappeared first, and then my sister Bethany. My declining health is a result of an old war wound, and unfortunately, the symptoms are irreversible. I didn't summon you here to watch me die. I need your help. Anything I can do. Just name it. Anything. Strange events began happening around the manor. After thinning out my staff, they ransacked my estate, taking whatever they could carry. The rest of the help was quick to follow, as they feared rumors of my family's curse. I can't help but think it's more than a coincidence that strange happenings that looks like have the increased the since I've been back from the war. I want to get to the bottom of this, but I'm just too weak to investigate it myself. I'm relying on you to step in for me. Of course, Jeremiah. The only reason I risk coming back here is to assist you however I can. My thanks to you, Patrick. What the hell is that? Sounds like it came from downstairs. I'll check it out. Lock the door behind me. Ah, love, I love the graphics in this. Reminds me of Tomb Raider. Stuck. Stuck. All right, so apparently a pistol is the perfect weapon to fight ghosts with. I'm not sure if I agree with that. Ooh, that's fancy. But at least I also have this cool stone thing. And now I have to go investigate this boopy sound. What if I use this over here? Do I get anything? So, okay, so he's got a family curse. His siblings were disappearing. Clearly, the guy in the blue suit ghost that I saw was one of his siblings, so probably the other one was as well. Stuck. Patrick, to the rescue! So am I like a ghost buster? Oh, look, there he is! Hey, I want to talk to you. Hey. Yeah, I want to talk. <laughs> Won't budge. Stuck. Stuck. Mm. I'm going to turn the volume up a teeny bit because it's not loud enough for me. Let me know if it is overpoweringly loud for you guys. Looks like a secret door, but it's just a pattern. There's a light leak underneath the stairs. Maybe it's a secret door. You never know. Stuck. Stuck. I just I'm just picturing him going up to the doors and just going like Ugh. stuck. Ugh. Like smashing his head into it. No, we're stuck. You can't possibly try the handle. Definitely jammed. Hello? Oh, there you are! Listen. Listen, I just want some information. Can you describe what you can only see? As the bonds of flesh are broken, the world becomes apparent. Uh... Are you saying you're smarter than me? <gasps> I disagree with that very much. Very much. Really, I want like a lantern or something. It's a pistole, you're right, it is. Oh, oh my god. It's not funny. It's not funny, dude. Look at the the mirrors work. Holy shit, that's so awesome. Yeah. Look at it. Oh my god, this is so great. <laughs> it's pretty rare that the mirrors work in games. Oh no, what's happening? Okay. You look shootable. I think I was correct in assuming. This ah!
Okay, nobody mentioned that there would be like horrible harpy beasts. I guess that was the noise that we heard. Oh no! She was so nice! Why? I forgot her name. Ah! Did I actually miss? I really thought I hit you there, but can I reload? Re oh, R does this. Oh, all right. What is reload? What is reload? Yeah, weapon action. Alt? Yeah, there's no reload, right? I didn't see one. Alt. Okay, alt works, never mind. Maybe it's just uh, varies per weapon or something. But I don't know why they wouldn't call it reload. Whoa! Spotnik, thank you so much for the prime sub. Welcome to Cheesy Horde and also Barefoot. Thank you for the bits. This is what happens when Lara's vintage boobs are translated into the contents concept of cargo pants. <laughs> yeah. This, this guy reminds me of, he's like an Irish Nathan Drake, kind of. Because, and also mixed with a Ghostbuster, which is phenomenal. Okay, I thought you were gonna die. And you didn't. Oh! Whoa! Well, right off the bat, it seems like a pretty fun game. I gotta admit, I like it so far. Won't budge. Budge. From the form, you can reload anytime. Yeah, I figured that out. Thanks. Stuck. Just alt. Just use the generic. Do something with your weapon key. Thought I'd be disappointed that it's a shooter? No, I love FPS games. I do. They're quite good fun. Good fun all around. I'm gonna see if I can snipe this guy. <laughs> did I hit him? I think I did. Take that. Oh, help me, Patrick! Whoa! Jeremiah! Those beasts were after me. What in God's name were those things? Yeah. They're called howlers. howlers. Well, I've never seen one before tonight. I've heard of them for years. From who? Those weren't natural, my friend. We're fighting more than superstitions here. Perhaps I was being naive not to tell you, but there might be something more sinister at work here. When I was a boy, I encountered something I can't quite explain. You see, there was this isle of standing stones that sits just off the estate. Someone had carved a sigil into each of the stones, something indiscernible. Father had many books on the occult, one of which contained a sketch of that very symbol. I took my brothers and sisters out to the island and read from my father's book. Well, what happened? Something answered. The ocean began to boil, and a great wind whipped against us as we stood in the circle, and my siblings huddled to the ground in fear. Eventually, the wind died, and the sea settled. Patrick, I know it sounds like the ravings of a dying man, but I believe those standing stones had something to do with this. What has once been a taint upon this family has now begun to manifest itself. But you told me you're dying. Doesn't this curse end with you? Who knows? My brothers and sisters are dead, but I don't think they're really gone. I've heard some servants whispering. They think they've seen Lisbeth on the estate. Shouldn't I mention... My family has come that... for me. I sense them, Patrick. By now, you and I know the supernatural exists. You saw the Howlers. And what about our encounters with the Tersante during the war? You still even carry the Gelzebar stone with you. It's a token of the shaman's life I took. That's all. I found a scroll with a picture of the Gelzebar on it. I believe it contains the way to awaken the stone's dormant power. Ooh, magic. 
Very well. Let me study this scroll overnight, and I'll see what I can do in the morning. This house still hides many secrets. I'm counting on you to reveal them and put an end to this mess. Secrets? I like secrets. I can do that. Alrighty. Let's let's learn how to do magic. Magic Irishman! Oh okay, I guess it was just that easy then. Alright. Now I've got bubbles! <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Oh, I can't put the fire out. That's disappointing! <laughs> I feel like Patrick really should have mentioned to Jeremiah that he literally saw his brother as a ghost and he was laughing and stuff. I mean, that seems like a really important thing to point out during that conversation, but whatever. Maybe maybe he's just not sure. <laughs> maybe he's like, it could have been anybody. I don't know. Somebody just playing a prank. Take that, statue man. Hello? Have you noticed anything strange going on? Apparently, Elizabeth's room was broken into last night during the commotion. Where's her room? Just down the hall from here. It's quite a mess. I mean, we shouldn't be worried about that. I guess he's like a butler, so... He's a very quick butler as well. He's really, you know... Old man in Lara Croft Mansion has got nothing on that guy. He's zippy. There's no way you could Stuck. lock him in a freezer. Stuck. Need a key. Oh, Bethany's room. Do I have any kind of map in this game? Probably not, right? Probably not. I don't think I saw anything about that. No, center view. I guess I should save. That would probably be a good idea. Let's save. Save! Yes, I'm sure I would like to save. Thank you. Hello? Oh, you're not dead! Wait, are you the same person? Hello? Tell me what you know about Lisbeth. Okay. Why, she was a fetching young lass. Quite the fiery temper, though. She could be placid and calm one minute, and then suddenly she's spitting curses and swinging her nails at you like an animal. Tis a pity her mother died birthing her. Indeed. Following her mother's Dad? death, I'd raised Lisbeth Indeed. like my own. In the end, no wasting sickness got her. I'd cared for her when she was sick and watched her wither away to nothing. Pity a young woman has to die in the spring of her life. Uh, now she rests with her poor mother at the family mausoleum. Uh. Her groundskeeper claims to have seen her recently. <laughs> oh man, seeing a ghost is never a good omen. Where can I find this groundskeeper? He's out in the gardens. You can get there through the kitchen. Your knowledge is appreciated. Thank you. Oh, man, I am the most chill Irish ghost hunter there is. Pretty great. What a mess! How could they invite me over with such a mess? Oh, thank you for the light. <laughs> Arr, yar. Look at my glorious hair flopping oh, when I move. This house needs a priest. A priest? What are you doing? What are you doing? Hey, what are you doing? I think this is a very valid question. What are you doing? Oi! I think it reloaded me. Did it reload? <laughs> did it reload me? I think it did. <laughs> well, 
Don't need shoot the help. Well, now you're telling me. Okay, fine. It didn't let me shoot the other guy, so I didn't think it would let me shoot that guy either, but I guess it does. <laughs> All right, we gotta go through this again. <laughs> Tell me what you know about Lisbeth. Good. Ha ha! All right. Try the quick save. It works. What's this over here? Ooh. A journal entry. J. Maybe L. Oh, now he's doing something that makes sense, at least. Ooh, she's got some dogs. Ew. Oh, this house needs a priest. Again, need to look up the hotkey for that. Uh... I am looking around. I am. I mean, you want me to, you want me to do this thing? <laughs> Whoa, okay. Damn. All right, cool, F, F3, thank you. Ah, there we go, all right. On nights when I cannot sleep, I look from my bed to the monastery out my window. The reflections of the matters that separate us ripple across my bedroom walls, filling the room with waves of moonlight. If, if, it, if it is quiet enough and the wind is still, I can hear them chanting. Their prayers roll across the water and fall upon my ears like a lullaby rocking me to sleep. It fills my body with such a quiet peace. And yet I cannot help but wonder how something that provides so much security could, at the same time, haunt me. At midnight, the chanting stops. The brilliant lights in the monastery go black, except for a tiny glow that emanates from the entrance of the catacombs. As I watch the single light, I can see the shadows of the monks at the entrance. It is then that I feel a slow, creeping dread rise from my stomach, as if the island somehow has a hold of me. I have overheard bits and pieces of a story that hushed conversations about monks who died a horrible death years ago among these grounds. It is said their tortured souls were put to rest within the catacomb and that their two brothers have stood guard at the entrance each night since. I cannot help but wonder why. Why are they waiting for and hoping to ward off? Are they uh, bound to the island with the same unknown force as I? The Lord works in such mysterious ways. But how can a just God allow... Oh. His own flock to die within sacred grounds. <laughs> Surely there is another force working among us, one capable of pure evil. A loving God could never allow such pain and agony. It is that force that eats at me at night and leaves my dreams unsettled. Are the waters enough to keep me safe? I wish just once I could lie in the grass outside the catacombs for a night and put these haunted dreams to rest. I must end these nightly visions and seek the truth. Elizabeth. Freddy Lux says subscribe for three months. Thank you, Freddy Lux. She's hype. Yes, pure evil. Yes. So, Evelyn's death. I spoke with the maid about Lisbeth, the sibling's mother. Oh, I can ha different. Uh... The scroll reminds. The scroll Jeremiah gave me has revealed a power spell. It seems that with power, concentration, and focus on my mana, I am able to release ethereal bolts of ectoplasm from my hand. Oh, I thought it was water. <laughs> Unreliable at far range. The mystical damage seems quite effective in close quarters. P. Love, Patrick. I spoke with the maid about Elizabeth, the sibling's mother. Evelyn apparently died while giving birth to her, and the housekeeper filled the void of her maternal absence. She said Lisbeth was a very beautiful girl with a short, violent fuse who passed away from a wa wasting disease. I take notes of the irony of someone who, ha who was so beautiful dying in such a heinous disease that calls for the destruction of their vanity. The maid said that the groundskeeper believes to have seen Lisbeth alive. Having seen Lisbeth with my own eyes, I can only believe this maid's frightful testimony. I'll go down to the kitchen and try to find my way to the gardens anyway. Lisbeth's room. The butler said someone broke into Lisbeth's room. Perhaps I should investigate. And objectives. Okay, so enter the gardens through the kitchen. Cool. All right. I like it. I'm glad there's more information and stuff. Uh, hello. Do not, do not shoot the staff. So the one thing that is a little weird about this game is there's no like interact button. 
So I cannot like attempt to talk to people. The interacting is just like ramming my face into things. So like that. So it's it's a little hard to, to get used to that. I gained a health pack. Can I actually hold on to health packs or do they just refill my health? Like in, you know, the classic FPS shooter games. Like, should I be not picking them up if I'm at 100% health? Because I don't think I'm able to actually open an inventory screen. I think it's just, I have an item or something. They're supposed to be stored in the inventory. So how do I, it said it was, it said it was enter or Q, but it didn't work. F, neck, okay, so F and V toggles. Use inventory, enter or Q. What if I hit F? Oh, whoa, that's weird. Okay. Oh, it's down on the left there. Weird, okay. And then use, and then I, if I wanna heal, then I hit enter, I get it, okay. Got it, got it. Okay, I think I came from here. Stuck. Help me! Okay, where did it, in here? Oh! Um, I missed every single shot. <laughs> yeah. Whoops, a daisy. All right, well, I think I, did I save everyone? I think I saved everyone. Was this, this person was, was she dead before? Or was this, no, wait, this is not. Yeah, I came from there. Yeah, I saw her dead before, but it was in the, it was in that different room. So I guess she's dead now, that sucks. Well, that's a pity. Okay, that didn't change. All right. I guess uh, the staff is becoming even more thin. I sort of want to do this too. Hey! Ow! Pew 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 pew! Pew pew! Pew 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 pew! Alt. Alt is reload. Alright. Cool. I guess. <gasps> oh no! Are you okay, sir? Hello? I don't think he's gonna be okay, everybody. I think he's gonna be dead. I guess I don't want to talk to him at all, though, so I'll just move on. I'm gonna try sneaking. K. Sneaking is literally just moving slow. Screw that. Hello? Won't budge. Who goes there? There's blood over here. This is probably where. Oh. That seems about right. Pew, 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 pew. Haha, you made it. Suck. Look a key! Servant key. Oh, there was a locked door that I ran into. Was that where was that? That must have been upstairs. I think it was upstairs. Won't budge. So my mana points come back pretty quickly. That's won't good. budge. Won't budge. Oh. 
have the key selected, I guess, in case I find the door. <laughs> I thought the chair was a bad guy. Jeremiah's head fell off. That is not a good sign. That is definitely a bad sign, I would say. Yeah. Oh, now he's even more disgusting, too. Oh, that second guy was like a... That was a, the next stage of the same brother. I see. Okay. <laughs> Can I help you? Who is that? Is that Elizabeth? Whoa, okay. Damn it, I keep missing. All right. Everything's fine, I think. Now do I follow her or do I do this way? Need a key. East wing key. I gotta go back where she was. Alright. Stuck. Won't budge. Won't budge. Stuck. I do not remember where the key was. Okay, now help back. Should I? I don't know how much it heals me. I'll wait for a bit to use it. Oh. Hello? Is this a chest? No. I feel like these rooms are really Won't missing budge. Uh, furniture. This is the kitchen. Oh, I see. Stuck. Lovely fire. Oh, hey. Are you the cook? Is that the door to the gardens? The door yes, to the gardens. Is. However, I don't have the key. I lent it to the maid. I believe she is cleaning Air Kaisinger's room today. It's located in the east wing of the house. I can't, but I need a key to get to the east wing of the house. Thanks. Oh, I thank appreciate you. your help. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Greatly appreciated. Stuck. So we gotta backtrack to go to the east wing first before we can do any of that. Lovely. Hey! Shoot. So I'm assuming this person that's sending all these things after me is Elizabeth. I mean, it looks like a female. I guess I'll go in here. Oh, hey. Hello. Hello. Hello? Pardon me? Hello? Where is it? I know it is around here someplace. What are you looking for? A book? Is there a secret? Ah, here it is.
Oh, I see. I see what you're up to, game. How the hell do I get up there? Can I knock it down? That would require physics. Spoopy 13. I and you, hello, thank you so much for the 13 months. <gasps> How are you doing? Well, this is clearly a lot shorter than that, so I think I have to get onto that somehow. Is there a ladder that I'm just not seeing? No, I think I'm missing uh, something, yeah? Maybe I get a spell that lets me... Uh, oh wait, can I use this? Oops. Push. No. Give me it. All right, maybe I have to come back. Kind of seems like that. becomes reality he will rise again the ritual continues through our blood who will rise again please don't tell me it's cthulhu because that is just old news man old news <laughs> even though i secretly kind of wanted to be cthulhu why not Oh. Creepy armor suit men. Don't come to life, okay? Don't do it. Was right. Oh. F3. Ah, Aaron's letter. Jeremiah, I'm warning you about Bethany. She has become obsessed with father's book since you left the war. She's increasingly paranoid and secretive. She locks herself in the sunroom and disappears on a horseback. I know she's corresponding with a number of outsiders. I fear she's making family visits known to these strangers. I doubt we want her bringing unneeded attention to the family. You know she is the last person we want near those stones. How could you have left us? I can feel the f fingers of this curse reaching out to us. Don't think you can escape. Uh, I lost my place. Oh, you know you have to look back. Damn it, Jeremiah. You have doomed us all, and you are a coward for leaving us. Can you hear the whispers, Jeremiah? Even another continent isn't far enough. Remember, I tried to go as well. I still heard them. Even in Asian dens and German gutters, I figured it out. It's inside. It won't be long before you cross the threshold. Brother, Aaron. The door to the manor gardens is locked. The cook says the maid is the only one with a key, and she is cleaning Kissinger's room in the east wing. Kissinger, while that name might not ring true for the servants, I'm deeply disturbed that Otto Kissinger would even be here. What the hell does that bastard want with my friend and his family? I can only be sure that when our paths cross, he'll be more than a stern word from me. He will get more than a stern word. I can only wonder how his plans to answer my questions when my hands are gripped tightly around his throat. Otto has done more to damage my reputation than I care to remember. 
I have no doubt that should he find out I've made it out of the Covenant estate, he'll stop at nothing to foil my attempts at uncovering the mysteries that seem to be plaguing my, this family and my dear friend. Interesting. Okay, there's some Patrick backstory for us. Thank you, Craig, for the bits. Thank you. Stuck. Jammed. Jammed. Um... About this door. Oh, good. Jammed. Jammed. Oops. That was kind of pathetic. Pew 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 pew. Well, rip another maid. Jammed. Jammed. Hi, Anya. Thanks so much for gifting us up to Gorum. Welcome to the JC Horde, Gorum. Welcome. Is that rain? Okay, sure. Hit me today. I cannot understand. Does that say bit or hit? I hope it says hit, but I think it says bit. <laughs> Lesbeth bit me today. I cannot understand what's gotten into her lately. She used to be such a graceful, proper little girl. She even licked her lips afterwards. I believe I should leave this place. Mary Turner. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. to be normal in that room, I would say. Ha! Showed you. Lovely statues. Thank you so much, I and you, for the bits. We're jamming with jamming, and I hope you like jamming too. Jamming with 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 jamming, and I hope you like jamming too. Thank you, friend. Thanks. And then I got it. I got it. Oh, that's so cute. I love that. Mana! <laughs> cool. Oh. Of course they've got a creepy church in there. Oh! Okay. Alright. I've done it. I stuck my face on the key and I got it. What key was that, by the way? <laughs> uh, I didn't pay attention. Did anyone see what it was? Actually, I should be able to just go like this and find it. Priest key. Ah, that makes sense. Okay, that makes total sense. So I'll select that. Anything in the pews? better with this, so it's kind of like a torch. Hmm. 
I can shoot things down? Oh my god, I probably could have shot that book down. Damn it. This strange crystalline stone seems to be a source of a finite power that may be used to increase the power and effectiveness of my spell casting. I must keep my eyes peeled and ears open for its pinkish hue and low hum. Oh, love Peter. Alright. Um cool. Well now I know that at least. Can I go back and read that let uh, book maybe? I'm not sure if it'll it'll let me backtrack that far. I could try. Oh god, I'm really stuck. I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Uh, um, okay. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready for that. I wasn't. Ah! I hate how it turns my head. Ugh, that was brutal. Alright. Turn the lights off, will ya? Well, I'll be darned. Okay, I'm not, I just realized I'm not actually backtracking. Thought I was, but I guess I'm not. Whoa, beautiful. Shot you in your butt. Okay. I gotta go I gotta move to the side. That is way better. Jammed. Jammed. Oh god. I wish those monsters dropped things. That would that would make it better. Getting harder to kill. Oh, <gasps> don't mind if I do. I'm bullets. Yay, a mirror. So badass. Rip another maid. Stuck. Okay, that goes to a place. Won't budge. That does not go to a place. Good. That's a good sign. Always a good sign. 
Excuse me. I think you're actually speaking backwards. What? Thank you, Iron You, for gifting a sub to Onion Man. Thank you so much. Welcome back, Onion Man. 12 months. Hooray! Can't understand you. Speak the right way. Whoa. Okay, getting the vampire guy vibes from that guy for sure. Spin me weapon. That'll make all my problems go away. Whoa. All right. Won't budge. Stuck. Stuck. Ooh. Why? Why is there a spike coming from the ceiling? What are these? Molotov cocktails? Hell yes! Can I use those? No? How do I... Uh, okay... I don't know how to use them. Hmm. Okay, whatever. Power really is here. I can feel it grow as this family shrinks. Ten little, seven little, five little Indians. So sad that I spilled covenant blood prior to my arrival. Ha! It was a trifle beneath me, but arriving without cause nor invitation. And the king's throne simply would not do. Insignificant fodder she was. But Patrick Galloway, how is it I did not foresee his arrival? Still strange to me that Jeremiah's affection for this Irishman did not waver with time, even after the wonderful night. At Cashel, I await his arrival, Otto Kissinger. Oh, Otto Kissinger, you're going down. Oh, look at this. How do I put that out? I don't want to burn myself, but that's definitely a secret way to go. Maybe I can get something. Okay. Yeah, I'll say new journal enter. Yeah, I'll say. Some connections are made to be discovered, while others should remain unseen. Some lands are best never spoken, as their hell lies in between. The words ring in the minds like a dream with irony not lost. For Oniros is simply that, the dream of forgotten souls, governed by none than but watched by many. With a sky that bleeds crimson, it is the only uncharted realm this scholar has witnessed. For the single time I attempted to graph the land, it seemed to belittle me by changing shape. I will keep watch over this tower until the entrance can be sealed. Otto Kissinger. Oh. Okay. Dang, this music is cool. Thank you so much, I and you, for gifting another sub to S4BO. Sabo, it looks like. <laughs> Welcome back, Sabo. <laughs> ah! Get out of here, creepy Cthulhu monster! Get out of here! Oh god.
Okay. Did that, like, add to my max health? Probably. Maybe? Or do I have to use it? No. Am I out of health? Well, I seem to have explored everything, so let's jump down into this crypt. Seems like a good plan. Oh, yes. weapon only in story. Created and forged of gold, it is a mystical weapon of Tibetan folklore that was lost in the mountains area during a mountainous area during a great battle. They called it the war cannon. Rumor has it that the person that holds this weapon must be a pure heart for it is fun to function correctly. It seems to be able to discharge some sort of cold sphere out of it. I wonder if I can slow down these bastard creatures. Bastard creatures? Yeah. Yeah, let's... Let's slow them down. That'll show them. So, it doesn't have ammo, though? Guess? Ah! What was that? smoke out of its snout. Got it. Okay. Well, that's, that's that's too bad. Okay, wait. But now I have the garden key. Now I gotta go back to the kitchen. Yeah, I think I did land on her. Oh, now I can do this! Right? Um. Hey, come on. What? 
It's ice. Come on. Hmm. What if I just walk through it? Oh, 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 oh. Ooh, that hurt. It didn't hurt that bad. There's a health kit right here. I'll take it. Worth it. Right? Maybe? I don't know. Maybe not. Oh my god, my weapon keeps jump scaring me. <laughs> How do I look with this weapon? Ooh! Yes. Glorious, Patrick. slow now you will never get me oh it does damage cool okay i thought it was just gonna slow him down but it's pretty good i would say stuck Now you put it out. out and now I can go through. Ah! Leave me alone! Stop. I like the growly noise. Gotcha. Hey. Hey, Tempo. Hey. Okay, I already had it charged, but it didn't save my charge. Thank you so much for the bits, friends. Thank you. 
Ah, you missed! You missed again! Oh, so did I, though. Touche. Won't budge. Oh. Oh, she's a lot less than she was. Whoa! Stuck. Holy crap and doodle dandies. That is a lot of guys. I don't know where I'm going. I really do not know where I'm going. I'm trying to get to the kitchen. Unsuccessfully, clearly. Oh, have I not been here yet? I don't know. Oh right, this is back by the bedroom? Yeah. Am I gonna find the butler dead now? Probably. Oh, hey, look! Stop! No, I want this. I want this. I want it. Thank you. Journal entry. Okay, according to legend, ether traps have the ability to tap into another ethereal place of existence, and in doing so, the traps themselves become black holes in which spirits can be whisked away and temporarily trapped into another dimension. And while I'm certain that these magical weapons were not meant for our eyes, I'm easily humbled when my course of studies proves truth to legend. Love, Peter. Is that a... That's an item? Oh, ether trap. Yeah. Okay. Um... I Stuck. don't. I guess I'll try one on a monster and see what happens. Uh, it came from there, so I'm gonna go this way. Jam. Jam. Oh. Need a key. Aaron's room. I'm in a whole new area. Oh, hi! How are you? Can I have that? I'd like. <laughs> oh, that's how I use Molotovs. Yeah, he's pushing me away, yes. You're so rude! Hmm. Well... Maybe I'll figure out what to do with that in the next room. Thanks, thanks, appreciate it. 
Ah, what's this? Ah! Now do I use this? Oh! Secret mirror! Awesome! Alright, Patrick. Igni! Woohoo! Oh, a new spell! Whoa. Give me the power of dispel! Every priest should have this power. I'm fairly certain this can stop or affect any and all magic I may encounter. I might try this spell in an obstacle of smaller magnitude, lest I fail in my most dire time. Yeah, that's probably a good plan, honestly. All right, cool. I think I should save a big boy save here. Oh, GOG.com, thank you for the host. Welcome, GOG friends. To a spooky stream. We are playing Clive Barker's Neo Time, which you can definitely find on GOG. Ha ha ha! I don't even know if it's worth killing these guys, honestly. It kind of seems like I should just run past all of them because they're just annoying and they never stop coming. Serpent key! Oh! Hang on, I didn't... I didn't feel like I explored this. Lock. I would like some more help, honestly. Workroom key, okay. Walk budge. Ooh, a dumbwaiter? Walk budge. Going this way. Jammed. Hello, Kilgore. Hello. Silver bullets. Ooh. Am I gonna kill a vampire? I mean, that one guy kind of reminded me of a vampire. So Won't budge. Stuck. What hurt me? I don't know. But I am seriously dying. Won't budge. Jammed. Jammed. Stuck. Stuck. All right. Stuck. Was that this door? Yeah, it was this door. Thank you, thank you, yes. Creepy lighting for a spooky season. Can I... Right! Down we go! For those of you that are new here, we are, um... Patrick... I forgot my last name. We're, we're an Irish... Irishman. Irish ghost hunter extraordinaire helping our friend Jeremiah who has a family curse. Um, and, uh, you know, his family members are disappearing and turning into horrible ghosty goos. So obviously we need to help him. It just makes sense. You know. Because what friend wouldn't do that for their other poor friend? Uh, I, they were like friends long ago in the war together or something, I suppose. But still, Patrick is a nice guy. Alright, what do we have here? That looks like a collectible thing. Fish? Fish! I can't take the fish. I wish I could. 
All right, so we're back in the kitchen, which is good because this is where I need to leave to get out to the garden. Stuck. To find the groundskeeper. Um, at least it was. Oh. Hello. There we go. Yeah. No, why? The cook, she's dead. Everyone dies. Okay, so I can either go out or I can go into the spooky cellar. That sounds like a great idea. Just great. Oh, hey. Ooh, right in the crotch. Sorry about that. Wasn't intentional, Mr. Monster Guy. Howler, howler friend. I think that was what they were called, right? Howlers? Oh! Okay, I need to use Molotovs now because now there's a bunch of extra ones. And I gotta check. Molotovs in the water? That doesn't make any sense, but you know. Okay, ah! Ah! It works! Okay, it doesn't. It only works if you hit them. Surprise, there we go. Okay, I just wanted to. I just, I just wanted to be able to grab most of the rest of them before we leave. Alright, what else is down here? Save! by a monster, the view gets kind of changed, which makes sense. Could you please? Could you please? Die. Thank you! That was slightly close. It's just a little bit. <laughs> Is there one left? I can't see anything. No, okay, I picked up all the Molotovs. I hope that was worth it. Probably wasn't. Jammed. Jam. Won't budge. Stuck. Really? Ugh. All right, I have one health left. So that's a bit unfortunate. I do the same thing. Come here. Ha <laughs> ha. Right. Get out this way. Won't budge. Okay, I think it's finally time to exit the into the gardens. Use the garden key. Here we go. I think I'm gonna do a big boy save right here. Whoa! Sorry about that. Won't budge. Okay, so we're looking for the groundskeeper who's apparently out here so Oh there he is! Watch out, Mr. Groundskeeper! Watch out! I'll save you! Uh or 
not. Okay. Hmm. Well. I wanted to talk to that guy, but, uh... I guess it, that won't be happening. <laughs> oh, wait, there's another... Oh, wait, no, that's just the butler. Is this the butler? Hello? Oh, good, it's his twin brother. Fabulous. What are you doing here? Just tell me where that trail heads off to. Bethany used to go horseback riding in the hills, but that was so long ago. Yes, um... That was not helpful at all. Jammed. But thanks, I guess. By the way, your brother just died a horrible death. You might want to get out of here while you can. Oh well. Let's go back this way. Did I get a journal entry about that? No, of course not. Wait, what's my objective right now? Dot, dot, dot. Well, that's very nice. We go for a swim in the pool. It's a very shallow pool. Okay. Put up another <laughs> help wanted sign. Yeah, we're gonna need a few of those. Jammed. Why are all these guards? What can you tell me about Lisbeth? People, they're all doppelgangers. I seen poor Elizabeth on the heather. When? I was coming back to the manor one evening, and I saw a silhouette perched atop a hill. At first, I thought it was a banshee, but I caught a glimpse of her face by the family mausoleum. It was Elizabeth. Poor dear. Whoa. Family mausoleum? It's to the west of the main house, through the trees. Is that near the standing stones, by chance? Standing stones? You have no need to go out there. There's nothing but bad luck and suffering for all who visited the toyland. I'll unlock the gate to the outer grounds, but I assure you that venturing out to the standing stones will lead to no good. Hmm. I thought it would be a great idea. I don't know what you're talking about. I finally spoke with a servant the maid said had seen Lisbeth. He is convinced that he saw her perched on a bill. What hill? <laughs> Perched on a hill watching him west of the manor. The family mausoleum seems to be the first place to investigate. Love, Peter. I mean, I would have gone and investigated the mausoleum without talking to this guy. Honestly. Won't budge. Thanks, bro. Beware of demons. Whoa! This is a new area. Okay. Wasn't expecting that. This is a. Uh, this is definitely on the hills. Hi on you. Thank you so much. Fancy on the bill. Hi. <laughs> Thank you so much for the bits, dude. Elizabeth. You're more of a meal than a man. Um. <laughs> I'm delicious. Then I agree. Deliciously handsome. Wow. She's spooky. Alright, well, is there gonna be a secret health pack over here in the corner? Nope. Okay, then. We I definitely saw her at the mansion as well. Not just here. I feel like there's gonna be secret something over here on one of these corners. No? Missed opportunity. Guys are no prob. Is nothing. Okay. 
go. You just gotta keep your distance from those guys so they don't jump in your face. Wow. Look at that distant terrain, though. Gorgeous! It's like I'm playing the Witcher. Almost. So close. Wait, is that where I came from? No. Nope, I'm inside. Okay, good. Whoa! What a jerk. It took forever to kill. Okay, there's definitely gonna be a health pack over here, right? No? No! Whoa! into the spooky red tapestries. I knew you were coming here boop me in the slightest. Anyone else? causes creatures I have killed to be brought back to life to join my cause. Oh! As disturbing as it is to call the dead back, I'm afraid that if the scroll doesn't work correctly, I might be raising these devilish creatures only to have a fight them all over again. There is no accounting for what might happen should I attempt to use it on living organisms. P. Love P. Okay. Can I use, try using it? On, oh, he's gone. Alright, well, never mind. I'll just push this. Okay, I'll just push this. There we go. again, shall we? That was the first death. Yes, it was. It was mostly due to my poor aiming skills. Oh. Oh, yeah. I forgot about you. There we go. Oh, I could try using the silver bullets. I was planning to save those for the boss, but maybe that's not could also try doing the, like, killing one of them and then raising the other one. Okay, let's go out into the lovely big area. Oh, I should also try using one of these. Oh god, I'm gonna die. Yeah, 
these green ones. These green guys. Oh, what about like a what about a um a Molotov or something? That would be better, actually. Yeah. Yes. Thank you. In my head. Thank you so much. Alright, I'm gonna try throwing a Molotov instead. I feel like that might be more effective. they behaved last time I threw them. I hit one! I've done it! He's on fire! Ow. Come through the fire. These definitely might be the silver bullet dudes, but I'm doing better. I think it helps. There we go. I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> Could have been better. Could have been worse. Um, how many healies do I have? Only one. Uh, well, you know. Dead equals winning. Exactly. Those guys are not the green ones, so. Victory is mine! Still have a hundred bullets. Still feeling okay about it. Oh wait, hey, wait a second. Wasn't this the guy that was hanging from the light post? Out front? Hey, were you hanging on the light post out front? Or was that somebody that looked very much like you? Covenant in loving memory. Okay. Should I just save? I'll save again just in case. Excuse me. Oh my god, it's dark. Don't hurt me! Oh, hi. Okay, good, you weren't green. That's fantastic. are skeletons. Something tells me that bullets are not going to be good on skeletons. Just a wild I'm guess. I'm for all of the cheese this past 15 months. Ah! Sir, ah! I can't see! I can't see where I'm going! Ah! What are you doing? Take that. Aha! Uh Aha! -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh oh. Oh. All right. I see. I, I see what's happening here. I can't select it. Damn it! I can't select it. Can I? Can I do that another way? Because it's really hard to select the ones on the side. I probably can. What about this weapon? 
Well, it slowed him down. Whatever. I'm just gonna go. Alright, I need to check. I need to check a control. Um... Next spell. Oh, three and four. Okay. One and two for weapons, three and four for spells. Okay, that helps. Okay, yeah, that actually helps a lot. I have no health. There's some health. Don't, I think it's gonna... Probably, uh, attack me when I... Do that, though. So, I'm gonna save. No? Free health? Are you sure? Okie dokie then. I'm just gonna go. Those skeletons are not worth my time. Oh my god. Um, are you gonna come to life? Oh, what's that? I need that. Can't shoot it down like a book. I knew you were gonna freaking Don't be mad, I'm right here. I'm right over here. He's very angry that he lost line of sight. Hey! Ah! Whoa! I understand your frustration, sir. To be fair, he didn't have much health left. Okay, so what if I try and do... I'm just gonna try and do this on this guy. Hey! Resing this guy now. For science. I said for science. Do I need more? How does it cost? Stop it! Ugh. Okay, it doesn't work on those guys. Fine. I didn't want to be your friend anyway. Excuse me. You guys are just not even worth it. my time and my bullets. Not even worth it. I need to get that stroller. Oh. 
I saved when I got here, right? Wow, there's a lot of skeletons now. And I'm going to die. Can't jump on that. Can't jump on that. Gimme! I think they're trying to throw rocks through the wall. <laughs> oh, Magic Cookie, did I miss your resub? Thank you so much for the 15 months, dude. Thank you. I'm so sorry if I missed that. Yes, bullet. I kind of want to reload just because... Oh, I think I got myself really stuck, actually. Oh, no, I'm good. Reservoir, right? They can be killed, yes. Hey, you're not allowed to hit me before you come out of the ground. That is seriously cheating. It is like epically cheating. Ha! Stay dead! You're probably supposed to jump in the water. I need to get that scroll, though. Alright, who else wants some? Bring it! How am I missing? Right there! Ow! What the... What the hell? Call shenanigans. Dying. This is a horror shooter game from the year 2001. Right now I am trying to get a scroll that's floating right there that I don't know how to get. And also I just learned how to kill skeletons. So that's good. So bone. 
around. I need that health. There's a health kit in there. And I need to get it. Ah! Or I'll just die instead. <laughs> Boom. Yes, get it? Ha ha! Yes, eat your heart out, Mr. Skeleton. Or rather, eat mine out, I guess. Alright, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna run. New plan! Uh oh, it's just bullets. I thought it was health. Damn it. Well, I really don't know how to get the health pack. I'm very upset. I mean, the scroll. I'm very upset. It looks incredibly important. But I just do not know how I'm supposed to get it. So I guess I'll just go on the boat and be mad about it instead. <sighs> Maybe I'll get it on the way back. Maybe it's like a, you go here and then you go back there later with a new spell kind of a thing, you know? I saw him up there. I saw him. hard but I didn't play on easy so I guess that's to be expected oh thanks thanks bro I will use that immediately jump down on me from that hill. I'd rather that did not happen. Ooh, friends! Hey, friends! Oh, or not. Okay, then. Glad you have worse aim than me. How did I? That's that's helpful. They drop bullets. That's awesome. Why do they hate me so much? <gasps> what did I do to them? I don't understand. I didn't. I couldn't have possibly done anything rude. I was about to help them. Need a key. A tower key. Gosh, this game has, like, drastically changed in atmosphere. <laughs> Definitely. I'm going up first, and then I will go down after. I'm going to save as well. Ah, oh, come on. Made me waste bullets, you jerk! What's this? Ooh. Did he just give me a new gun? Ah! Not nice! I was looking at my new gun! Oh my god. Oh my god, stop it! You guys aren't even the. Uh, uh, 
That's so annoying! It's fine. I'm sure three health is more than enough. Right? I'm sure it is. I'm sure I don't need more than that. I mean, clearly. Clearly I've been doing fine. Health wise. <laughs> Anyone who needs more than 3 HP in a shooter game is just a noob, right? Just a noob. I, but still, I'm not going to save because... I am probably going to die any second, so that would be safe. That, that's a great one. Ah! Me head! Really? Huh. Alright, fine. Fine. Whatever. I'm just gonna use my health kit right now. I'm pretty sure I saved after- I saved after that! I, I did! Load. Where's quick save? Does this mean the mo- Uh, yeah. I guess that's the quick save? Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Okay. Um, do I have... Molotovs? No. I don't. Okay. He's dead. So now I'll save here. Loot this. Go try the door, which is definitely gonna be locked. Jammed. Jammed, sorry, not locked. Jammed. Ah! Dodge! Epic dodge. A lot more bullets down there. So I'm gonna be a little bit more bullet crazy. This is much better. This is how I planned it all to go from the very beginning. Ow! Okay, not that though. Not that though! No, no, no! No, no! It's all going horribly wrong again! Oh, you're a green guy. Uh oh. It's all going horribly wrong again. <laughs> They're so fast. They're so fast. No game. God, this is like Wolfenstein all over again. Load my stupid quick save. That's what it's for. Oh yeah, I couldn't I could do that, that's true. But the game it does the automatic load thing. And it doesn't load the most recent save, which is quite annoying. Okay, I'm just gonna run. I know I tried this the first time and it didn't work, but I'm just gonna do it again anyways. Because, you know, maybe I'll get lucky. Didn't get a key, did I? Need a key. No, okay. I grab some of these bullets and then I'm gonna go that way instead. I'm just gonna bring all my friends with me. Don't need. Come along, friends. Ow! What's that? Is that a horse? A donkey? What is that? That looks like a donkey. Um. Hi. Kill the donkey instead of me. You know, it's delicious. Lots of meat. Lots more meat. Definitely more delicious than Patrick. Patrick meat. You don't want, you don't want Patrick meat. Three health again. Ooh, gonna dodge. <laughs> ah, hello, what 
Yes, you have. Ooh, a rifle. I'll take that. Did I actually, like, pass that? <laughs> I have three hit points, though. <laughs> oh well, who needs hit points? I can only hope that someone will find these scribbles of mine. Someone who can continue my quest, for I may not be long for this earth. I seek a magical talisman, an evil weapon known as the Scythe of the Celts. I fear that this weapon has fallen into the wrong hands, and so I have undertaken a quest to find the Scythe. Before it was taken from this ancient monastery. You see, hard as it may be to believe, there is a way to travel back to the days when this monastery was populated with the wise monks who first found the scythe of the Celts. These monks were versed in the ways of magic, and they had a, mort uh, a portal that would allow them to travel across distant lands, instantaneously across distant times. I know not exactly where this portal is, but I do know that three items were required to open it. A golden medallion in the shape of a sun a potion made up primarily of mercury, and finally an ancient scroll on which the incantation to open the portal was written. I myself had found this medallion and hidden it nearby, but the other two components elude me yet, and now it appears I will never have a chance to find them. I have broken my leg, and I fear that these strange dog beasts that roam this land can sense my weakness. They come closer with each passing of the sun. I fear that they will soon attack. May faith be my armor, Brother Jonathan McMuir. Alright, cool. I mean, I don't have a lot of, of faith, although it is possible. Let me in, let me invoke sneak, which is K, which just makes me go slower. But I assume these guys are not going to be my friends. Definitely not. Gonna be my friends. I'm going to do a separate save, actually. So I'm worried. I'm slightly worried about this. I could go around, but that seems like the pansy way. Hey guys. Um. Ooh, nice rolls. Kill you for your boots, Irishman. You're supposed to say that before you kill me. <laughs> that was worth it just for that. Damn, that was awesome. Excuse me? Oh, I put it at the top. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what? All right, so they didn't actually attack me until I shot them. So maybe they're like. Passive aggressive. Nope, 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 never mind. <laughs> I'll bleed you slow, I wish. I just feel like the taunt isn't as effective if you do it after I'm dead. I'm just saying. You could <laughs> you could practice that just a, just a bit. Okay, so I'm gonna have to uh, be very accurate. Damn it! <laughs> They're both trying to kill move me. <laughs> You must have a death wish. <laughs> yeah, apparently I do. I mean, who else plays an FPS game with 3 HP? <laughs> uh, no, I don't want to load that one. I can do it, damn it. I just gotta be clever. What about- I haven't tried using Ether Trap yet. I mean, I tried it, but it didn't do much. Could try it. I'm not really sure how to... 
make it work effectively, though. If I could kill one of them before they get to me, that would be great. Okay, one down. No! <laughs> I should have saved. <gasps> oh, can I skip this? Okay, good. I guarantee you there's gonna be a health pack, like, right after this. I could duck. Yeah, I, c I guess I could try hiding behind something. Though. Maybe if I duck right here. Oops. I'm reloading! Don't shoot me! Don't shoot me! Okay. He's got a key. Oi! Cheese the hell out of that guy. Alright, save it. <laughs> oh, oh, he did drop bullets. Okay. I already have max bullets though. Alright, out of stealth. Alright, I just saved, so now we're gonna be totally fine, right? Game? You gonna give me a health pack now? Stuck. It would be a great time to give me one of those. Excuse me. Excuse me, pardon me. What? He's reloading. Okay, I need to get I need to get behind some No <laughs> damn. They're so inaccurate, but sometimes what it just takes one freaking shot. Apparently I was too far away for the kill move to work. <laughs> okay. Come on. If I just hit caps lock, it does that. Is that just is that also reload? Oh, okay. Alright, what if I go this way? There's a skeleton in there. What if I go around this way? No, I saved. I saved the game. Alright, I could appear here, but that doesn't really help me because I still have to go past them. How do I get in this barn? Rumbly thunder. Okay, maybe if I... It doesn't say it's jammed or anything. Why is that? Oh. oh. <laughs> I think I killed myself. <laughs> I don't I, I guess it has proximity damage. Alright, fine. 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 It's fine. Okay, how do I get how the hell do I get in? Can I climb? I wish I could climb. Stuck. That would sure be great. Oh, there they are. Uh. Yeah, duck behind something. I'll get you. I'll get you, you bastard. Yes. I love it. I love the cheese. All right, cool. And we have some extra bullets. All right, save again. We'll just save over that one. Now can I go into the barn? Won't budge. 
Dodge. Oh, now he says that. All right. Did one of those guys have a key? Oh, I got the tower key now. Wait, do I have a tower key? Priest key. Yeah, I have the tower key. So I could. Go I should go backwards then, right? Yeah, I gotta go up to the tower. I thought he had a key. Okay, if I need more bullets, there's bullets back there. Um, I'm, I'm really, I'm probably gonna die a lot, you guys, so just, you know, brace yourselves. <laughs> but now I know that I can cheese those guys, at least. Did I already loot this guy? Yeah, I think, yeah, it was just... Skellington there. But there's definitely gonna be health in the tower, right? Definitely. Uh-oh. Please close the door. <gasps> Sun medallion, chest key. How does that help me? There's no health in here. God damn it. Shit. Oh, biscuits and gravy. Ah! Clive Parker's dying a lot. Nom 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 nom. All right. I gotta go in and get out. Go in and get out. Wait, I have a health? I had a health the whole time? Where did I get the health? All right, cool. <laughs> oh, good times. Good time. Okay, but I didn't kill all of these guys that are up here. So I'm pretty sure I need to just run the hell away again. Um. Uh-oh, I went the wrong direction. Chest key. Okay, what chest? What? Exactly. Like, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, what? What chest? And what is this? What can I use this medallion for? Save. Ingredients. A f attack. Oh, wait, what? Oh, right, yes. <sighs> Objectives. Collect ingredients for the time portal. The medallion, the time incantation, and the flask. Find your way into the abandoned farmhouse. Okay. So, the farmhouse is last. So, maybe that key will open something up here? I don't remember seeing a chest. Unless I was being horribly... Oh, death counter? Yeah, that's a good idea. We should. We should have the death counter on. Um, how many times do you think... Do you guys think I've died so far? Like, 30? <laughs> I don't know. A hundred? No. 732? No. <laughs> Alright, we'll compromise. We'll say 25, alright? There, that's that's somewhere between 20 and 732. That works. <laughs> okay, it is enabled now. <laughs> what to... Uh, yes. <gasps> going the right way? <gasps> Why does this seem wrong? Did I just turn myself around? Yes, I did. Okay, great. Cool. Haha. -ha. Wrong hill. <laughs> yeah, I want to use quick save and quick load way more often, but like I'm still I'm worried about my health. Like I want to 
I don't want to get stuck in a situation where I have three health and I can't do anything about it. Then, you know. So I want to use the big saves as well. But yeah, like now is a pretty good time to do quick saving. Because I have some health. I bet this game is still pretty fun on easy, by the way. Won't budge. Huh. I guess I just go backwards then, because there's no chest to open. I can't remember a chest. Ugh, I just I probably just didn't know to know that it was a chest. You know? I bet I saw it somewhere, but I didn't because there's so many chest-looking objects in this game that look like you could open them, but you can't. So, I guess I'll backtrack? Unless is there... Maybe there's a way that I didn't see to go? There was a... There was a door on another house by the farmhouse but that one just said it wouldn't budge it didn't say it needs a key so we probably can't open that one i'm gonna see what happens if i go back maybe there's an obvious chest or something and i'm just dumb and didn't see it i don't, I don't know though it's a long way back doesn't seem right my gamer senses tell me it's not right Uh, Enski, thank you so much for the host. Thanks, friend. There's no shame in easy. I agree. Maybe there's some secret health around here somewhere. Can I go in the water? I can, surprisingly. Really unpleasant water noise, though. All right, I don't think we're supposed to go back to the boat. Nope, definitely not. Okay, good. That, that that rules that out. There's a chest somewhere on this island, and I'm just dumb and didn't see it. Good. I don't suppose my did my objective get up. No. Okay, maybe uh. Maybe there's a chest near the farm that I didn't see. A donkey-shaped chest. <laughs> yeah, what if it's just hiding like next to one of those abandoned walls or something? Could could be. That's true. We don't die in the water. Yes. That's pretty common in games. Water is lava. I was also expecting the inside of this tower to be a lot bigger, too. I thought there would be, you know, I would. I thought I would be going up to the top of it, but... It was not to be, apparently. hit one time there. I have no freaking clue how I did that. I mean, all skill, you guys. All skill. I meant to do that. I definitely meant to do it. Okay, so there's something around here that I missed. Tell me, donkey, what is it? What have I missed? How are these donkeys still alive? No one's speaking. Oh! It's a script! Oh! Alright, guys. 
we had to do was go back and it opened automatically. Hooray. It was just a matter of running back and forth a few times. I bet there's something really dead up there. Really, really dead. Health packs? Health packs, please? Game, come on. I bet easy gives you lots more health. Like, that's the one thing I bet it does. Oh god, this guy's green. Shit, did I save? I think I did. Hurry up already! Hurry up and eat my head. Okay, he's a green guy. I'm gonna try using the silver bullets on him this time. I'm gonna try that. Because I did get a lot of silver bullets. So that'll be an experiment we can do. Yeah, okay. And I already have... Yeah, I have that stuff. Okay, good. Open sesame! Use a little bit more ammo that time than I wanted to, but... Oh! You know, I really feel like that was kind of dumb because... Uh, you know, because you killed me in one hit, and I feel like that's... Just not really that fair, but whatever. Whatever game. That's fine. I guess I only do have 23 health. Last time I got really lucky because he just sat there. I'm just gonna waste bullets. Bullet! We can just go back and get these bullets. And everything will be fine. And save! Okay. So now, I want to switch to... Silver bullet. This is my first time trying this, so... Let's hope it works. Yep, it definitely works. Great. Okay. But then we really want to switch back because, you know. Uh, yeah. I don't use too many of those. All right, there's a dead guy here. Um, <clears throat> I'm not <gasps> seeing a chest. Not seeing one. Good night, Ninjari. Good night. Thank you so much for coming. Oh, I see. Um, not liking it because you know. Oh, God! I did it. Come here. Hey. <gasps> Face me like a man thing. Face me like an Irishman. Dude, what's with all the ammo and the no health packs in this level? I almost shot you. Okay. Perhaps I should have then. How many times do I have to shoot you in the head? Can I have that? Oh, thank you. Oh my god. <laughs> I like how it's a blue model. It's a blue icon. I know I only have two health. I'm aware. I'm aware of this. A double barrel shotgun of potent force. It appears I may choose between firing 
individual or double shots depending on my taste for maximum effectiveness in close quarter combat. Love, Peter. Okay, I see. I'll take these as well. Oh, I'm gonna be ambushed out there now. There's a chest! But how do I do that? <laughs> Alright. Um, did I miss anything else? Yes. <laughs> Ow. Okay. Good. That works with these guys as well. Ow! Ow! <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. I want to I want to redo that bit anyway cuz I had no health. Okay. This guy is not going to Is he going to come after me this time? I guess not. Fine. Be that way. Alright, then we get shotgun douchebag here. Don't shoot me! Nope. What an asshole! It's fine, right? I only got shot one time. I'll save it. I'll save it with that. Oh. Quick load! <laughs> yes, I know, I know. Oh my god, this level's hard! Alright, um... So I'm gonna switch to the silver bullets again for this. Shot them both once. There we go. It's all fine. Save. I really feel like the game is being a jerk by not giving me health. Don't you guys think, don't you guys think it's been like way too long since I got health? Or is that just me? Maybe I'm just really, really bad at this game. <gasps> that is also entirely possible. <gasps> yeah, that's just ammo. Again. Nine months. Are so well. Thank you so much for the resub. Nine months. Woohoo. Jeez, I. Okay, I've been there. This is clearly how I get into this room with the chest in it. Where I am probably going to get ambushed. <gasps> the trapdoor key. Trapdoor key? Okay, that's gotta be in the basement then, right? Just open that for, for shits and giggles and whatnot. Take those. Okay, 
you're not a green guy. Switch back. Ah! I don't want to be hit! Okay, it's all fine. Alright, I just want to switch back my pistol to normal bullets so I don't waste all of those. Save. Can't pick those up. Of course not. The trap door key. <laughs> yes. Oh, I have to go back this way. There was... Yeah, how did I get to that area? Oh, it's back here. Yeah, back here. Down to the spooky spookiness area. Oh my god, is it... Ah! Freaking trap dorky! <laughs> I found a health pack, you guys! Oh my god. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. <sighs> okay. Um, well, let's do. I guess I'll carry the ether trap, because why not? Not like I have any health. Alright. Um, I do need to end the stream pretty soon. But I'm gonna keep going for just a few more minutes. Woo! This is getting pretty exciting, and I finally found a health pack. This is this is definitely gonna be totally safe. Totally safe. Okay, the water doesn't kill me. That's good. <laughs> It's a walking on skeleton sound. I like it. I think there's gonna be- Ah! I was just about to say, you think there's gonna be skeletons down here? Look, get out of here with your dumb rocks, okay? You and your dumb, dumb rocks. That's probably bad if I fall down there. I'm gonna venture a guess. Um, um, where? Oh, up above. Outside already. Do I drop? I guess. Huh. They're coming for me. I seem to be stuck. Can I not? I can't go around that way. Fine. Come and attack me then. <laughs> Nothing? <laughs> Bummer. Ah! 
already used that health, right? Yeah, I did. Figured. How can this be breached? This? This hole? There appears to be hidden chambers beneath the monastery rooms. There are several large bricks blocking the way in, too large for me to dislodge. Perhaps if I found some sort of explosive, I might be able to blast my way through them. Love, Peter. What if I just use that weapon I've been using to blast through things? It's been working just fine. I guess it's not strong enough for that. Fine, be that way. Fine game. I'll find. I'll get a rocket launcher. That'll. That'll do the job. Jammed. Jammed. Ooh. A big save too because I feel like I'm making decent progress right now. There's a dead guy up there. like to come and sabotage me? No? Why, uh, why don't I believe it? At all. Can I get up here? I can? <gasps> Whoa! Oh my god. A health pack. Don't fall off. That would be so humiliating. Can I not climb up this? Oh, yes, I can. Yes, I can. Where there's a will, there's a way. Ooh, another will. Ooh. Mana well? I got plus 10 mana points. That's awesome. I know, I have so much HP right now, isn't it crazy? Alright, so that was absolutely worth exploring. But I'm really surprised the game didn't throw some crazy shit at me. Oh, there it is. I found it! Another health pack? These small magical trinkets enable me to hold more of my mana and allow me to fire more spells without fear of draining my magical energies so quickly. I need to keep my eyes out for more of these mana well containers as they'll no doubt help me with my spells and my other endeavors. Love, Peter. Patrick, I mean, not Peter. You know, one of those P names. The more Irish one is better. Are you sure? Are you sure there's nothing else? Are you positive about that? Okay. Okay. The game is nice now, I know. It made me suffer and now it feels bad. Yes. I can't get up to that, so I guess I just go down here. Ah. Late harvest, day of our pertinence. In the year of our Lord, 1231 AD, a garrison of brothers was dispatched to this outer island to establish a vigil over the ring of standing stones in the Isle of King's Head. From our monastery, we have kept watch over this site for well over 200 years. Without a doubt, it is a focus of unnatural power, which must be guarded with persistent vigilance. For years, we were content to stand sentinel over this megalithic site, and we 
bore our burden with honor. Now I must confess great concern over the direction the abbot is guiding our brotherhood. It has been a long time since we have had any communication with Rome. Fierce storms have isolated us on this island and swept away many brave brothers who have attempted to make the crossing to the mainland. Isolated from our superiors, the, abbey, the abbot has undertaken an investigation into our predicament, convinced that we are bewitched by agents of the supernatural. It has been decided by the abbot that we will exhume the graves that lay betwixt the ring of stones. I fear what we may find. Late harvest, day of toil. It has grown bitterly cold since the day of the big snow frost. Our fields and the crops are ruined. These are those on the dig described discovering the withered body of a man clutching an ancient scythe. Though it is sacrilege, the abbot ordered the men to retrieve the weapon for study. The abbot hopes that in understanding the artifact, we may shed some light on the strange curse we are experiencing. Late harvest, day of Congress. One of the scribes, Brother Abris, was overtaken with bloodlust while studying the scythe. He struck down a number of our brothers. If it hadn't been for the timely intervention of Abbot Constantine, many, many more would have fallen. The abbot declared that the ill-wrought weapon must be destroyed before its wicked nature infects us all. The ritual requires us to destroy the item and may be more dangerous than the weapon itself. We will walk the border of shadow to be freed of this cursed weapon. May we be protected from the fiends. I pray we are released from this curse, or else may the saints preserve us. Brother William Duffnell. Huh. So, is this a separate curse than Jeremiah's family, or is this all the same curse? It sounds like it is the same thing, but I could be wrong. Okay, uh, now where do I go? <gasps> Maybe this way? Oh, but, you know... Okay. Oh. Hello. Is this the... Oh, it's the olden day. The monks. So whatever. <gasps> whatever. <gasps> Bye, Enski. Bye. Thank you so much. Have a lovely day. Oh boy. What is that glowing white thing over there? Oh goodness. Oh, look at here. Thingy. What are these thingies? I haven't used them yet. I should definitely try using one of these. What is that? Oh, that was just a monster. I think I'm gonna switch weapons again here. To this guy. part of the vision. Oh, he's dead. Oh, no. <laughs> Jerk. It's not funny. Oh, yeah, it's not funny, Elizabeth. Don't be such an asshole. Alright, whatever. I'm going this way. Bye, Skellington. He doesn't have any clue where I went. He's so dumb. Ah! Well, not 
not going to get through that right now. I see something up there. bit scary you guys the old the old ammo situation um, okay yep thank you so much I hear a purple thing I think that's what that is just save, right? I think I did. Let's just load. Yeah. Wow. Wow, dude. Wow. Alright. Inchy, inchy. <laughs> How do I get this? Maybe if I shoot it first. Like if I shoot it. Alright, let's save here. Cause screw that guy. I just have to fall properly. Right. Can't shoot it. Sneaking, right, yeah, that would probably help. Sneaky, sneaky fall. Ugh. Oh, help. Okay, I'm sneaking, right? Am I sneaking? Yeah, I'm sneaking. Uh, large amount of jumping 
finesse. Or rather, falling finesse, I should say. <laughs> if that does exist. Okay, so now I got that. Good. And now we go somewhere out. Ooh, whoa, what is over there? That is the thing I saw up above. Hmm, this could be useful. Oh, yes. It's not a rocket launcher, but it'll get the job done. Look. All right. Whoa. I'm looking. Hey, guys. What's up? Show me something cool. Standard dynamite. I'm sure this can do damage to both the surroundings and those vile creatures. Okay. Well, we found the dynamite, so now I remember there was an area, um, you know, in the beginning where we had to blow, blow it up. I was looking around. <laughs> Damn Keebler. <laughs> Keebler? <gasps> Who's Keebler? Damn keeper. Don't know. I, mean, I think I should, uh... I don't know where I should drop down, actually. I have no idea. It doesn't even matter. I don't know. Oh! Okay. I guess I'm dropping down right here. Oh. Oh, right, you. That's fine. You can stay in there. I don't care. Hello? Who dares enter my realm uninvited? <laughs> it is I, Patrick. First of all, I should probably heal. Are you just... You're just gonna throw rocks at me? Is that... I mean, a little underwhelming. Just saying. Okay, bye. Looks like I can go in here. Maybe? Stuck. No, it can't. Ooh, nice nice church shadow. It's kind of ominous. Or the where's the thing I needed to blow up? Wow. Why are they all over there? I don't know, but I already got that, so I don't need to worry about it, right? I don't know, I feel like that wasn't actually the boss fight. There wasn't even any music. I think she was just like annoying me and I couldn't actually do damage to her, so. I'm just gonna go back and uh, find that thing I was supposed to blow up. If I can remember where it was. It was like right at the beginning. Stuck. Hello. Oh, this. This. Okay, yeah. Alright, so save. Then. 
and dynamite. Um, do I throw it or place it? <gasps> Boom. Now this is a good place to stop. Hell yeah. Okay, so <laughs> that's gonna be the end of the stream for today, everybody. Um, uh, but before we stop, I'm gonna do a giveaway because I almost just forgot. So, uh, <laughs> nobody leave yet, okay? Because I'm gonna give away a game. Those of you who Suck around to the end of the stream. Get an opportunity for a free game. A free horror game from GOG. Some of them are are pretty scary. Others, not that scary, but kind of scary. Can I just minimize this? That would be better. Okay, there we go. So let me just get the codes first here. All right, so just a second. Uh, I will set this up. So the game I'm going to give away today is, um, let's, let's give away an equally cheesy horror game today. Let's give away Call of Cthulhu Dark Corners of the Earth. Alright, so I'm going to open the giveaway. Type exclamation point win cheese. And uh, you can win this game from GOG. Uh, I can personally vouch for this game being awesome and cheesy and completable, the GOG version. <laughs> Most importantly, it is completable. So much fun, super cheesy action FPSC horror game just really really fun so yeah but obviously you know only answer please if you don't have the game already and whatnot I'm gonna turn the music down again so thank you to GOG for the horror keys for this month I will be giving away uh, one game at the end of every stream for the next like 10 streams so the next two and a half weeks every stream I will have a game to give away at the end all horror, all good, all GOG. All GOG all the time. My initial opinion of this game? Uh, Clive Barker's Undying is very fun. Yes. It reminds me a little bit, uh, like, the gameplay kind of reminds me of, um, well, I guess it just reminds me of all the shooters that I've played. But for some reason, it mostly reminds me of Wolfenstein, uh, Return to Castle Wolfenstein. Maybe it's because it's the same graphical era, but it just kind of feels like it plays sort of the same. But this game is, I think this game is harder. I'm pretty sure. I don't remember what difficulty I played that game on, but um, yeah. It's good. It's very fun, very cheesy. Not very scary, but I can definitely see like the monsters jump scaring you if you're if you're afraid of that kind of thing then for sure exclamation point win cheese to join the giveaway if you like the game you already have it well if you win I just will pick someone else then yeah I, nor I like to, to play games on normal difficulty for the first time, which is why I didn't pick easy. Um, but it's fine. I mean, I don't mind dying every once in a while. You know, it makes it a little bit more exciting, I suppose. <laughs> so. It's been fun. It's been fun. Those moments where you have to run around with a couple HP and reload a few times. That's all part of, you know, retro FPS games anyway, right? <laughs> Yeah, the interface is a little clunky. 
The, the UI is kind of difficult because there's like so many things to switch between and how the ammo is mixed in with your normal inventory. It makes it hard to switch, like, it makes it hard to switch from silver bullets to regular bullets and the pistol and vice versa. I kind of wish there was just, like, an alternate firing mode option for all the weapons, like how the, the shotgun has um, the double barrel or single barrel option. If you could just toggle between silver and regular on the pistol, that would be nice. But that's asking too much, I think, you know, because it's just a pistol. So, yes, it's challenging, but in a fun way. It's very fun. It is very fun. And I haven't got super stuck yet, so that's good. <laughs> I usually get a little bit stuck in these games, you know. Figured out how to fall off a beam? Yes. Figured out how to die in a lot of ways. I love the really cheesy death animations. <laughs> I wish the uh, the monster guy, the howler guys had more than one. That would be cool, but the, <laughs> the human guys. <laughs> That's just so goofy. Alright, I think I'll give this until six, which is three more minutes. Um, if anyone wants to still join the giveaway to win Call of Cthulhu Dark Corners of the Earth from GOG. Type exclamation point win cheese in the chat. Does the, does the, uh, win, let me see if this works. Yeah, there it goes. Nice. Yes, they are a nice touch. Nice and cheesy. And I like how I figured out that I could cheesy shoot the humans. Because if they're behind cover, even if they duck down, you can still shoot them in the head. <laughs> and they can't shoot you, so that's pretty funny. I think this game is a, like, a similar length of Outlast, so we should be able to finish it this month. I mean, this week, sorry. This week, unless I do a lot more dying, I guess, and get stuck a lot. But I think it's like 11 or 12 hours, so. That's true, we don't have to hide from monsters. <laughs> It's really hard to run from monsters in this game, except the ske the skeletons are easy to run from because they're slow and dumb and they just throw rocks. But the those other guys, the howler guys, are super fast, so it's hard. We're a lot harder to cheese them, but it's a fun game. I like it. I can see why people really adore it, and it's just it's just one of those games which happens with a lot of shooter games where the game itself is just like a fun experience to play even if you're not paying any attention to the story or anything at all it's just kind of fun you just run around and unlock doors and shoot bad guys and enjoy the cheese just like just like uh wolfenstein return to castle wolfenstein that was the same kind of experience for me which i think is why it reminds me of that i'm not sure which i still think that return to castle wolfenstein is slightly cheesier but this one has other elements of a different kind of cheese. And of course, Call of Cthulhu Dark Corners of the Earth is also epically cheesy. All right, it is six o'clock, my time. I'm gonna pick the winner now. Last call, if anyone wants to join, exclamation point win cheese. There are quite a few people that entered, so good luck to everyone. This will be a GOG key, by the way. If you win the uh, game, then send me a direct message on Twitch or Discord, and I'll send you the key. So here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Hulker, congratulations, you have won. 
Hulker, you're in Discord, right? <laughs> Sorry, Bjorn, you're too late. Congrats, Hulker. Uh... Alright, cool. Um, Hulker, send me a, a direct message in Discord or Twitch, whichever you prefer, and I will PM you your key, okay? Congratulations! Tomorrow I will be giving away another game, so come back. I'll be playing more of this also. More Clive Barker's on Dying. I'll be playing it this week until I finish it. And then uh, next week I will be playing Amnesia the Dark Descent because that's the, the another one that everyone voted for. And then after Amnesia the Dark Descent, we will start Resident Evil. So I'm pretty excited for both of those games. Thank you everyone for joining me. For my stream again i really appreciate all your eyeballs and your support and uh congrats on the game again hulker let's see if there's anyone i can raid too bad kilgore is not streaming right now Ooh, oh, okay, well, Dave is playing Amnesia the Dark Descent, so, you know, I guess spoilers for next week, but if anyone wants to go watch Dave play the game I'm going to be playing next week, I will send you guys over to Dave. Otherwise, I will see you all tomorrow for some more Clive Barker's cheese. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I'm going to raid in five seconds. All right. Have fun, everybody. Bye-bye.